As we look back on the 2018 year, it's been a tremendous success for all of us who live in this region. Our gross regional product has gone through the $10 billion mark and beyond. Our growth has been 4.5%, building on 3.6 over 10 years. This provides, provides enormous stability in our region. It's the breadth of our economy and the strength of the investment there is here that is driving this community. Council also maintains its Queensland Treasury Corporation financial rating as sound with a neutral outlook. Good economic management allows us to reduce debt despite rising costs and this keeps costs down for each and every ratepayer. A well-planned and maintained infrastructure system is critical for success. Council recently opened the Boundary Street part of a $50 million upgrade that will see the completion of Mort Street upgrade early in the new year. These upgrades are in readiness for the completion of the Toowoomba Second Range Crossing. Council is planning for the future of this region. We have made a clear decision to update our planning scheme to cope with the modern trends. When our current planning scheme was developed, there was no such thing as the Second Range Crossing or the Wellcamp Airport or even the dream of an inland rail. Refreshing our planning scheme will help us develop the infrastructure that we need in the future. Each year we welcome more and more visitors to the Toowoomba region. Part of the attraction to our region is the world-class gardens that make us Australia's garden city. This year the Australian Tourism Awards again recognise the Carnival of Flowers as the best national major festival. We are proud of our reputation as a region that cultivates the best parks and open space that can be found anywhere and we will continue to build on this. Our region was successful in becoming an internationally accredited safe city. We are already one of the most livable regions and this accreditation tells the international community that we're also a safe place to live. Yeah.